Hi hello people welcome back to smart learning youtube channel today in this video i'm going to tell you what is the process after you got selected for kpit and one more important thing is guys the results has been declared for kpit check your mails whether you got selected or not don't worry guys if you are not selected infosys is also hiring watch the previous video for the apply link and eligibility criteria so apply as soon as possible and also if you are very new to our channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon so that you will get all the notifications whenever we posted a video okay then let's get started first of all congratulations to the people who got selected for kpit and the people who got selected for kpit will receive this type of mail you can see the mail on the screen they said that you will be receiving your offer letter very soon intimating with your date of joining and work location as well so you have to wait until they will send the offer letter and date of joining within this time limit what is your responsibility means you have to collect all the documents which they have mentioned in the mail those are first one is passport size photo second one is pan card third one is aadhar card fourth one is permanent address proof fifth one is present address proof sixth one is all your semester marks card seventh one is course completion certificate or provisional degree certificate these are the documents you have to keep with you i think the people who got passed out in the year 2022 they might take some time to get the provisional degree certificate so that instead of provisional degree you can submit course completion certificate college will provide that course completion certificate once after you will clear all your subjects in eighth semester these are the details they have mentioned in the mail apart from these what is the next process means once you get the joining date and location at first they'll give genesis program training for all the freshers like other companies kpit is also assign you some tracks in this genesis program with some due dates so you have to complete that particular track within the due date and also there will be some mandatory modules so everyone every person should complete those mandatory modules within the given time based on the track that they have assigned to you in the genesis program they'll conduct assessments on weekly basis and monthly basis like this after 3 months of training they'll they'll conduct a main exam for you you will be having two attempts to clear that exam if you fail in the first attempt you can take the second attempt to clear that exam after this exam you will be changed to full time employment and then you will be allocated to some projects in kpit of course every company will do the same process like uh, first they'll give you training and then they'll conduct you an exam you have to clear that exam within the two attempts or maybe it may be three attempts and also this final exam will not be that much tough you can easily clear this exam what you have to do means you have to learn as much you can so that you will perform very well in the projects these are all the details related to kpit i hope the video is clear everyone is understood and guys don't forget to apply for infosys of campus hiring watch the previous video they are offering two separate packages one is 6.25 lpa and other one is 9.5 lpa so don't miss this golden opportunity that's all from this video guys stay tuned in our channel for more latest updates and also visit our website smartlearningyt.in you will find all the of campus over there with the eligibility and the apply link so do refer our website daily to check where is of campus hirings for different companies if you like this video please like the video and do share the video don't forget to subscribe my channel till if you have any type of questions feel free to reach us in our instagram page or telegram account links provided in the video description thank you all thank you for watching